Good day, Squire. So the brand new dragon of the month, the Cancer Dragon, has now become breedable in DML. It's a legendary water and shadow dragon with a base attack of 78 and a base health of 244. It's got an interesting set of elements and looks pretty cool, so let's go through how to breed it. So to have a chance of breeding it, you need to breed together two dragons that have the fire, earth, water and metal elements. There are loads of different possible combinations that you could use to do this, but today I have cut it down to the three best combinations for all players. So even if you're quite new, you still should have a good chance at breeding the Cancer Dragon this month. So the number one combination that I would suggest for you to use would be the Fire plus Rust Dragons. You can also replace the Rust Dragon with the Terracotta Dragon from the Divine Event 2, and this combination will work just the same. So this combination has seven other possible combinations, giving just above a 3% chance to breed the Cancer Dragon. The good thing though, is that most of the possible combinations have quite low breeding times, the highest being 12 hours for the elemental dragon. This means that you can rebreed pretty frequently, so if you tend to log in many times a day, this is the best combination for you. Number two. So the second combination I would suggest to use for those that only log in a couple of times a day would be the metal plus elemental dragons. You can change out the elemental for the cookie and quake dragons as well. So this combination only has four other possible outcomes, meaning the chance to breed the cancer is quite high at about 5%. The breeding times of these dragons are quite a bit higher than those from combination one, however, so you'll be waiting to breed for longer on average. If you don't log into the game for at least six hours while you go to school, go to work, then this combination is actually great for you. Number three, if you don't even have any epic or rare dragons to use, then do not worry. The third combination I would suggest for you to use would be the snow plus war dragons. These are both common dragons, so they're super easy to get. And if you breed these two together, then there are up to 10 other possible outcomes, meaning you only have about a 2.5% chance of breeding the Cancer Dragon. The breeding times for these are also decently long, but there is the chance that you might breed the Elemental or Rust Dragons while you're using this combo, so you could always breed one of those and then start using one of the two other combinations instead. And in case you are unsure, the breeding time of the legendary Cancer Dragon is two days normally, reduced to one day and 14 hours with VIP active, the same as all other legendary dragons. If you see this breeding time in your breeding den, then congrats, you have gotten yourself the Cancer Dragon. But moving on to your actual breeding dragons, I always suggest that you should level them up to at least level 15 when you're trying to breed legendary dragons. I tend to level mine up to 20 or 25 since I can easily afford the food to do so. The reason for this is that the higher their levels are, the higher your chances are of breeding rare dragons, aka legendaries. So make sure you've leveled up your breeding dragons to at least level 15. But the other important thing to remember about breeding legendary dragons of the month is that you'll often need to rebreed many, many times before you get them. A 3-5% to chance of breeding the Cancer Dragon isn't very high, and sometimes you'll breed it on your first try, sometimes it might take 80 tries before you get it. Leveling up your dragons is the only thing that will help increase your chances, but it isn't a guarantee, so make sure you're rebreeding your dragons as many times as possible this month. So I hope this video helped you out. If it did, then let me know in the comments or in the Discord server. If you need any other help or advice, whether it's related to the Divine Event or anything else in game, then the guys on the Discord server will be more than happy to help you out in real time. But apart from that, best of luck with all of your breeding and Divine Chest RNG.